This is the box that Dark Magician Girl comes in, and to be honest, I really, really love the box. The Japanese go all out, like, from the quality of the box and everything, like, it's really, really cool. This was released by Max Factory, and it was released for the 20th anniversary of Yu-Gi-Oh! Damn, like, has it really been going that long? Um, but the box is, like, a really high quality, it's glossed, it really depicts the colour scheme of Dark Magician Girl. It's got the light blue background with the texture and the pink accents. Um, and in Japan, obviously, she's known as Black Magician Girl. Here's one side of the box where it shows what you're actually getting. A, a nice little zoom-up shot of Dark Magician Girl, the figurine. It says Black Magician Girl at the top. On the back, it shows more details. It's got um, Dark Magician Girl inside the actual circle when she's set up. It's got the back of her and the side of her to show her gems. And it's got, if I could read Japanese, I'd read that out to you, but I can't. I really wish I could. But it's really, really cool. Like, I, I really want to visit Japan and just buy so many more of these figurines. The other side is another shot of Dark Magician Girl with Black Magician Girl at the bottom. And it's got the Magician Summoning Circle in full with a little window so you can peek inside and see the figurine. On top of the box is the Magician Summoning Circle, another image of Dark Magician Girl, Black Magician Girl, and another window so you can look at the top of her. Here she is, out of the box, all set up. And I've got her sitting next to her teacher, the Dark Magician. Like, I think she's absolutely perfect. I just love her from the pose that she's doing, from the colouring, to the metallics, everything. And as I show you, like, all the details, you'll see just how, like, gorgeous this little figurine actually is. Looking at her finer details, like, you can see, like, the blue of her hat is absolutely perfect. And it's got the perfect amount of darker blue shading. Um, it's not like the other ones where it's like that really block light blue colour. I love that they've added the shading. Um, her hair is textured, it looks like proper hair even though it is plastic. Um, her face is just stunning. She's got her big blue eyes, she's got her rosy cheeks, a little smirk going on. She doesn't look too super cowy. She looks perfect. Even the little details on like her armband, she's got like actual like cool textured gems in there. I don't, they're obviously not gems but they just look so amazing. Even her little necklace is a gem. I've seen other ones where the necklace isn't like actually textured like that. It's just a block colour. And I love that attention to detail. It is from Japan, so they've kept the original like chest piece there as like the, the star. They've censored the star over here and given her a heart in the UK and US. I love that they've kept it the original, obviously, as it's from Japan. And just her whole outfit, like, it's just perfect. She's got the little gems on the side of her, like, of, of her boots. She's got, like, a really cute, like, sitting pose going on. It's it's like one of the scenes, I think it's the first scene when Yugi's um, battling Arcana, when he first summons Dark Magician Girl. Like, she, it's just, it, she looks like she's just been summoned. The base, I really like that it's not flat like the Dark Magician's. It's, like, raised, and the bottom of it is, like, a darker blue, so that when the light hits, it's like a blue going all the way around. Looking more fine details, she's got the orange band around her waist like she does in the program. She's got the little pink accents on her boots. She's got the pink skirt, the little pink cape going on. We won't look under there because it's really, really rude. And finally, her staff is a different colouring to the rest of her. It's more metallic. And I thought I wouldn't like this, but I do like it because her staff is a big focal point of Dark Magician Girl. And it, it just br it brings it out nicely. It's a nice standout feature. And it wouldn't be Dark Magician Girl without it. The Dark Magician Girl is a firm childhood favourite character of mine. She has been for such a long time. And when I saw that this was getting released, I really couldn't pass it up. I placed a pre-order and I'm really glad I got it. So anyone who's in kind of two minds about getting it, I highly recommend it. The detail is there. You'll absolutely be blown away when she comes. But I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Give me a thumbs up if you did, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!